mean, the time flies by, Michelle. But what are you doing this weekend, by the way? Well, Lindsay, believe it or not, I am going skydiving. What? I do not believe that. That has yeah. to be false. Is that false? Yeah, it was a lie. It was a big fat lie. <laughs> <laughs> I can't imagine you skydiving. Michelle. No, no. Why not, Lindsay? I'll and I can't. You. Can you imagine me skydiving? I mean, what do you? More what do you than think? me. More, More than, than you. you. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Like <laughs> if you said it, I'd be like, oh, wow. But I would also kind of be like, okay, yeah. Like, would you ever do that? I don't know if I'd be able to step off the plane because you know how you have to step off yeah. yourself, right? You have yourself strapped in. I just think I would end up back down on the helicopter or the plane or whatever you use and not, I paid all this money and I would have not You'd done it. You know, it's, up mm. Yeah. Mm. yeah. Mm. All right. So you used an expression there, Michelle, and that is the okay. one we're talking about today for our listeners. Yes, 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 yes. So believe it or not, uh, my niece recently used the expression, believe it or not. And I, I have these moments where I'm like, I think that's a good one. And I'm going <laughs> to teach it on the show. Um, I so I wanted to teach it to you guys. That's fantastic. I love it. Wait, how old's your niece? Oh, she's only seven. Oh my gosh. I love it when I hear like my niece, you know, kids starting to act, talk like yeah. adults. They're starting to become fully formed human beings. Hey. Oh yeah. <laughs> I, this I think... is not like only like, this is not like a childish expression. I would yeah, say. Yeah. No, no, no. Um, totally. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, this can be used in anywhere. I mean, in the workplace anywhere. I mean, it, yeah. uh, it's used just, you know, to introduce something that's a little bit surprising or shocking or unique. I mean, yep. would you use this one, Lindsay? Yeah, totally. I use it a lot. Actually, I like it, especially when I want to make fun of myself. Yeah. You know, for example, I could say, believe it or not, I'm cooking dinner tonight because <laughs> I never cook dinner. Right? I'm usually not the one cooking in my uh, household. It's so a good, instead of just saying the surprising thing, it's yeah. a good signal like, oh, something kind of fun, something kind of interesting is coming. Yeah, making fun of yourself, something unexpected is coming. It, guys, this is a great way to build a rapport with someone and to share something about yourself or about what you're about to say. So they get more insight into you when you use it, especially to talk about right. yourself, right? Right, right, right. Exactly. That's true. All it's a good right. Way. Now, Michelle, I know our listeners love role plays, so we're going right. to give them some today. All right, let's do it. All right, here we go. Here's the role play. Okay, so where's the nearest laundromat? Oh, believe it or not, there's one right around the corner. <laughs> in New York, Michelle, is it common to have laundry machines in your building or do most people go to the laundromat? I would say it's a mix. I, I had, mix. um, 